back on uh, Dong John's performance in the preliminaries so far. He had a three-setter against Joko Suprianto of Indonesia, won that 15-8 in the third. Very easy win over Darren Hall of England, five and six. And then was taken three sets by Jens Olsen of Sweden. He won that one 15-4, but lost the second, 14-17, won the third set 15-9. Hoya Larsen has gone uh, three sets twice as well. The first time, a uh, little bit of a surprise against the Hong Kong number one, Tam Kai Chun. Uh, Hoya Larsen won the lost the first set there, 14-18, but then nine and six in the successive uh, sets. This is Dong John, 23 years of age, world ranked number two. And uh, as you can see, a right hand there, and he's had a good year so far. Won uh, the Chinese Taipei event uh, right at the beginning of the year in uh, January. Quarter finalist last year in Sweden, semi finalist last year in Singapore. Uh, was a runner up at the US Open in Atlanta. Recovered uh, on the star and then uh, won the Chinese Open, which was the big one in 1995. Hoya Larsen, as we say, uh, having beaten Tam Kai Chun in three, then beats Park Sung Woo of Korea. That was a very impressive performance, eight and five. And then Rashid Sidek that really got Denmark off to a great start. He's uh, 31. But, uh, left, uh, there's a left-hander. He's actually there one meter 89. I'm not quite sure that he's actually as tall as that. He's world ranked number three. Uh, he's a shade over six feet in my reckoning. But, uh, there we are. He's uh, 31 and uh, very much the experienced player. But Dong John, I think if it uh, goes down to fitness, you've got to favor Dong John. But an interesting contrast between these two players. Uh, Hoya Larson likes to play a very considered type of badminton moving the shuttle around and Dong John when he gets sets his mind to it really gets uh, on the attack Danish supporters there hoping for the best let's hand now to our commentators Toto Damaji and Amy Chan uh, Jakarta where the Rudy Hartono at the time was the uh, spearheader was the best player at the uh, Indonesian team and the first match like I mentioned Dong Jong of China and the, last, the, the end part of 1995, they, he came in and won three tournaments in a row. He won in Hong Kong, China, uh, Thailand, and to follow up was fourth in a row gentlemen, with the This is the Chinese first Taipei. singles of the Thomas Cup semifinals between on my right, Denmark, represented by Paul Eric Hoyer Larsen. <laughs> and on my left, China, represented by Don Jun. Johnny Quack from Malaysia is going to be the referee. And uh, as you can see right here, Dong Jung Denmark. on the far side of your screen and Paul Eric Hoyer Larsen playing in the bottom part. Love all play. Both players has played three times in the uh, round robin tournament. But they're unbeaten. Oh, what a great rally. And first point. I honestly believe after winning the second All England titles back in March, I feel like in 1996, the man to beat for singles are this man you're looking at. Not this one, but the man you're looking at right now on the screen. A very clever strategy by Dong Jong. One. You can see right here, got a very soft drop shot, and again a deceptive cross court drive. That's not a good start for Dong Jong, as we all remember One. that in the qualification round in Auckland back in February, in which he was playing against Rashid Chidek in the final of that uh, qualification match, in which he was called for the surface fault on the match point. Um, he just became flattered, flabbergasted, and lost the game in the match. Two. It is so important Lock. for Dong Jong to be able to sustain and to return well on uh, Denmark's Paul Eric Hoyer Larsen attack. Yep, you're right. Again, great to 
interception oh. shot by Dong Jung. He has to mix Love it. Two. He can't let Eric Horton-Larsen look at the lob or the push by Dong Jung because he is he has the height advantages and he's a, he will be able to put so much pressure as you can see right there. Two. Great sharp angle by Eric Horton-Larsen. Great shot as well, Dong Jung. Very high. You can, you can see him live up and have a very sharp angle down there. The drop shot. And with a very accurate jump smash. Love to. Yeah. First on fourth error by the Danish. Oh, Eric Hoyer. So important for the first single to start well playing in the Thomas or Uber Cup finals, as you can see to uh, yesterday how much uh, Three, first two. players to be on the court giving momentum for their own teams. Yeah, you're right. You got to motivate it, the other players from the team. So you just feel the tension here. Yeah. It was a really great smash by poor Eric Hall Larson. On the return, Dong Jung was hit on this frame, so it was short. That was wide. Zabizova, three, two. In many different ways, Paul Eric will, will try to give a short look at the net for Dong Jung. I'm hoping that he's going to lift it up. Good play by Dong Jung. Dong Jung moves two. It is so dangerous to see to give Paul Eric Hoyer Larson a push in the back. That's why he just keep playing in front of the net. That's long. Three. Three two. two. Well, very good judgment by Dong Jung. But I think he's going to dominate the net. Well, he needs to dominate the yeah. net for Dong Zhong if you want to see the victory for China in the first single. Well, it's one of the Kwai Rahalasen's favorite shot there. You can see the left hand is so powerful. Forehand smash. White. Three. We all. Oh. One thing about uh, different things with Paul Eric Hoyer, besides he has the height, he has the advantage on the uh, height on the other Chinese player or Asian Three. player. But one thing about oh. the European of Paul Eric Hoyer, he has a good footwork as well. Well, that's true. And also a very smooth strokes. And look at here. Well, Dong Jung got a very good deceptive shot. Four, three. And a good service. Shot by Paul Eric. Three. Okay, five. Yeah. That was too high. The return by Dom Jung is too high. Well, he had no choice. Yep. Three five. Okay, right here. Great. Smash by Dom Jung. To the body. Five. Three. Five 
three where both players have played a very tough match in the earlier round as well Dong Jong had to be pushed um, one against Joko Suprianto Three, Larson. Five. They had a great match playing Rashid Chidek as well on the last day of the third run. Van Robin in the group A. Sandizova. Five. Three. John John. Three. Currently number two. Players in the world. Look at here. Well, he read poor Eric Larson's mind already, and he waited down there. And with a great smash to the body of poor Eric. 6 3. Savisova. 3. 6. Great smash. Over. Three, six. What a spot that he picked it up. What a corner he picked it up. And Don John was nowhere close. Wow. Great deception. Six. Great drop shot by Paul Eric. It's four to six now, Amy. Yeah, you can see his touch. Well, just so delicate. And we, the shot just lined on the. Uh, it's white. Samizova, six, four. The facial, the face, the expression of all Eric Hoyer Larson focusing and concentration. Again, great shot. Samizova, four. He knows four, that Dong Jong can't six. lift, cannot afford to give the look. Of the surface short like that one. Oh, a little bit of shot there by Six, Paul Eric. Four. You can see both players are great attacking players right here. You can see Dong Jong smash to the backhand side of Pori. Again. Seven, four. With his great steep angle smash. We got one more point here. Seven, four. So far, the Dong Jong has played flawlessly. Giving so much pressure, giving it that cross court. Clear by Dong Jong is just giving a little problem for Paul Eric. Oh, just wide there. It's over, four, it's over eight. four, eight. And it's just why you see the punch kill. Well, it's very powerful. Unfortunately, it's why. You don't miss. You don't see much Eight. miss in that one from Five. Paul Eric Hoyer. You know, percentage-wise, he would make it most of the time. It was over now. Eight-five. Just wide again. Five, eight. The 
this is where the focus and concentration you know, needs to be applied by both players now. So it's over again, 8-5. Eight eight five. Five. See right here, make a setup and make the kill down there. Smash the body of here. Reaction is so fast, and smash the body of uh, poor Abraham Lawson. Just right on that one. Five. Well, he has missed a few of that this morning or this afternoon. Nine five. The first break called by Paul Eric Hoyer Larson. net and can I climb over that and everything so far has gone almost down Jones way mm. that's why it says in the scoreboard as well 9-5 for the youngster from China yeah. great smash okay. by Dong Jung there Five. the last time they met Dong Jung it was in uh, Chinese Open mm. where Dong Jung beat him in the final In. 11, five. Well, look at his facial expression, he's so determined to win this game. Easy shot. I made a mistake to it. Well, poor Eric stayed in five for a long time. Six. That's a six <laughs> uh, well, that he didn't want to stay that long in the five points. So fine. Well, that may totally makes Corey okay, Larson very angry to himself. He slipped on that one, I think. I honestly believe that he slipped. Thirteen six. Six. Uh, he was behind playing against Rashid Chidek uh, three days ago. Came back and beat him in three games. And he's behind again, 13-6. Well, uh, the second to the corner. 6-13. Yeah. That looks Zola. good. All the control 30, goes six. to Dong Jong. That's wide. 14, game point, 6. That's good. That's too good. Yeah. Six, fourteen. Very sharp. And just right on the line. Six, fourteen. I think. Well, Eric is still searching. Uh, the focus and concentration that he needs to get. Yeah. And he's behind. He's being indecisive with a clear from Dong Jong. By the time he takes it, it was too late. Uh, second game point, 14-6. That was not easy. 
He was so far back, it was too high. Dong Jong didn't play bad. I mean, for Eric did not play bad, but Dong Jong just played superbly. Yeah, you're right. Well, I think Dong Jong stay in his strategy and try to manipulate for Eric. Look at a slight smash there with very powerful strokes. Over here, right here, jump up very high and make the kill. Dong Jong will try to continue to apply his pressure strategy if you can't give the tall Danes into the attacking mode. It would be too difficult. I just believe that uh, it's so important for the Danes if they want to retain or to go back to the Thomas Cup final since 1973 or Double. have a chance to win it. The Thomas Cup, they have to succeed with the all of three single players. Great next shot by Dong Jong Ying. Well, again, he's tried to control and dominate at the net. Look at right here. He spins it, just tumble across the net. Yeah, I think this is becoming more frustration for Paul Eric Hoyer because it is so important, again, repeatedly you mentioned, uh, for Denmark to have a good start. Yeah. Look at all the return. This is a short one. Somehow, Paul Eric looks like he's gambling a little bit. He's trying to attack every single time. And the time right there, he moves forward. And didn't see the shuttle came back on him. He's committed, Eric committed. It's love three or three love for the Chinese. Four. He's in. Love. Well, we haven't seen much of these. Unforced error or a mistake made by the Danes. Yeah, totally misjudgment here. Well, that was a perfect uh, serve though. They landed right on the line. Whoa, Seven great shot. Well, I still find that um, Poir is searching for a right strategy against Dong Jong. And here with a deceptive Drop shot here, right on the line. Let's look from the line One. though. Four. Good call by the line judge. One four first point. So England and European champion currently. The return, though. Unbelievable. But those are the thing returned by the Chinese. This could break the camel's back. Look at here. You see, it was caught by the um, force error. Look at that one, too. See, you, uh, all this is shot that Dong Chong is just coming out of the blue. <laughs> Somehow, whatever he throws in, it was a hit winner's hitter. Five one. And again, wrong footed Paul Eric. Short one. Six one. So uh, Dong Chong, as we all know that he's from Beijing. Well, he used to be a, a trainer. Well, with the national squad, and uh, he kept on practice, and uh, finally he appreciated by most of the coaches one, and six. chose him to be one of the national squad player. Well, good thing the coach decided to choose him.
short again. Well, you can see he really played very cleverly with all the setup down here and create a wide opening at the behind side of poor Eric Hall Larson. Six one. Fifteen six went to the China. Our first game. Yes, that one is white. Seven. One. Well, it's almost certain that the Chinese will probably take the first game of the first match. The way Dong Zhong is playing. Again, just Eight. long. One. Eight one. Look at him, he's so confident and with his top form. Again, 10-1. 9-1, one. Nine. Nine, one. I'm one. sorry. It's nothing to do with Pablo Eric Lor uh, Hoyer Larson's not playing well. But I think give credit to Dong Jung for this man right here for playing superbly. I mean, almost a lot. Ten. One. And you can see right there, very frustrated Dane. Paul Eric Hoyer Larson. 10 1. But the only thing he could do right now, trying to ask for the players of his teammates to help him. Again, 11 1. The return by one. Paul Eric Hoyer Larson was very, very short. Well, I just think of last night when Suzanne beat Bang Su Yu in Level Love. Well, it's just almost, you're right, it's exactly <laughs> like this one. 12, one. Not giving a chance whatsoever, 15-1 now, 12-1. Could be 15-1. Oh, well, it's very hard to say. Let's look. Oh, that one was in. Yeah. I would certainly look one, that he was going to go out because everything has gone to Dong Jong's way. <laughs> I wouldn't be surprised if that one was going to go in. Yep. Again, there it goes right there. 12, 1. Right now, the Danes is being steamrolled by the Chinese. 15, 6, and now the Chinese lead 12, 1. Oh, that's a short one. Oh, unbelievable. What? You're right, everything is just on Dong Jung's side. Or even with the net. Let's see whether Boy Eric Hall Larson can get this right back. Well, he can't get it back at the same time. He has to think about one point at a time. And it's not just he has to do well. I think another thing is he's just hoping that <laughs> the way the timing of the Dong Jong will go down a little bit because he's just being in a sky high. Yep. Yeah, look at that Thirty shot. Over. Thirty two. There's Ye Xiao Ying in your left. <laughs> Short again. Is over. Two. Well, that is 30. the first one in the second game. Don't Jong make this error. Well, this Three. is the first game, 30. first point. That Paul Eric could be in the dictating the control of the point. Tape and land it right on the behind side of Dong Jong um, for Eric. It's in this is time, over. it's over. Three. Three thirteen. A 
Good play. There's one thing about Paul Eric, he can't think, he couldn't think about the whole thing, just one point at a time. He wants to get back to the point, to the match, as a matter of fact. Don't try to make it happen. Oh, okay. See, there's one at a time, Amy. This is oh, five now. Yeah. Unbelievable. For Dong Jung right now, he needs to get back into that momentum again. Live from Denmark, Paul Eric Hoyer Larsen. Getting five points in a row. Still four. Yeah. It's more respectable, though. Well, the table has turned a little bit. Seven. He gets a flick. Great shot there by Paul Eric Hoyer Larsen. Right, where he's so dangerous, you, you can't lift the clear high enough because of the height of his. the question of whether Dong Jong can sustain the stamina. It's not the stamina. I energy. think it's all in the mind right now. It is all in the mind. Can he beat himself? Can he overcome this pressure? <laughs> this is the time for Dong Jong. Make a move because he's been down. He's been last seven points. Poor Eric Larson. Again, there's a mental mistake again, Amy. Yeah. Eight, well, he can't slow down. Again, it's wide. Well, it's. Um, Well, the referee or the line Nine, judge <laughs> can't extend his arm because well, there's so yeah, many preps. Well, yeah, I was quite, quite confused there. <laughs> because he <laughs> extended, he would hit someone next to her. Yep. Yeah, <laughs> 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 well, we can take a shot over there <laughs> and have a look. Okay, for poor Eric Hoyer Larson, he needs to be careful here. Well, can you believe it? Eight points in a row. It's 113, right? Well, yeah, I know, but still, for Paul Eric, he's not out of the wood yet. He's, he's still in danger. He's behind. More importantly for Dong Jong himself, though. Again, there he is right there. He is in the same position as Paul Eric Hoyer was a few minutes ago, in which he's guessing instead of reacting into the point. Yep. Again, there's 10 right there. This is, you're looking unbelievable. <laughs> Turn around of momentum. The rally is still very short. Again, what a play by the only one champion. As you can see, though, the eyes of the Paul Eric yep. right there. You can see the focus is back. <laughs> Out of the polar bear. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> There it is right there again, 12 points. This oh is unbelievable, gosh. Amy. This has been unbelievable. 12, 13, he's only one point. The mood has changed. Just long. <laughs> he hit it in the tape or in the frame of the record of Paul Owen. Well, Eric himself. So oh, that's what he went wrong. This is one ring now, Amy. Can he keeep going to this? Because both the way, can <laughs> Dong Jung stop this momentum of uh, Paul Eric? Yeah, yep. Paul Eric can keep momentum. This is another. Again, this is all not physically. It's all in the mental, Amy. Yeah, that's right. Psychologically, he's going to win. It's all just on their mind. It's shut. A short one. You gotta get your first one. 
You've got to love, if you're watching this game, the drama in the Queen Elizabeth Stadium in the first semi-final of Thomas Cup between China and Denmark. As you can see right now, Dong Jung starting to concentrate more. And this one point, it's probably is more difficult than getting the first 12 point for, for Paul Eric. Yep. Smart play by Paul That's Eric, over. not trying to force the action. Well, we can see that the tension is too great between the two players. Short. Well, there goes the tie break. And you know it's coming. You can feel it. It's coming from the Danes. And well, Dong it's 19-0. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I said. It's what Dong Jong is asking to himself. What really happened? <laughs> and, you know, we have seen numerous times, Amy, that players caught and suddenly lose the concentration. They worked so hard to come back and losing it after they came back. Oh, no, I you can see right there, Dong Jong. With the push and the clear, beating Paul Eric Hoyer Larson. Now with the setting, level. <laughs> just wide. This is the first point. Probably Dong Jung was asking, where was that point come from when I needed it? It's five point. Deuce. Great return by Poirik. Short one here. He's in. Call it in. Too low. See a player behind so far back like that. You have two plays, Amy. One was trying <laughs> to get back into the match. After you get to back into the match, how to finish it off. Nice looking for the the rhythm back. Oh, come on. What, Amy? Come yeah. on, what? <laughs> it's Dong Jung's turn. Oh, hit the tape of the net. That's white. One, two. Well, at a time like this, sometimes your hands would be more sweat a little bit. <laughs> yeah, all wet. Two, one. Also, Zhang Ning, Ye Xiao Ying. One, two. Just wide. Three, Three one. one. Inch wide. Still playing very clever. With a drop shot and create a wide opening on the backhand side of Dong Jung. That's <laughs> in. Three, one. And he was out of the point anyway, Amy. I mean, yep. he was late to react, and there's nothing he can do. I'm just hoping to let it out. If he returned it, probably would be too short. Play by Dong Jung. Next point, what? That's 4 1. This is match point. <laughs> he had the opportunity, just mishit it. 1 4. 1 4. Maybe this is, could be Paul Eric last gap. Four. Still a sign of life on the Danes of Paul Eric Hoyer Larsen. Down 13 1. Got him back into equal level at 13 all. Right now he's down again 2 4 in the deuce. That's 
Great shot by Dong Jung there. Uh, three and four. Uh, Dong Jung may be asking and thinking what was happening when he was playing against Rashi Chidek in, Oak, uh, in Auckland, down in New Zealand, in which he had this same opportunity but couldn't finish it off. Yep. There goes, now it's a game point for the Danes. Well, psychologically, well, I think the Danes got the advantage. Oh, exactly. Well, of course. I mean, for the Danes oh yeah. right now, you know, Amy, yep. especially for, uh, for Eric, hey, you lose it. Yeah, of course, I was behind 13-1. Yeah, you can see Don Joe, facial expression, so that. And there you go, right there. What a comeback by the two-time All-England champion for Eric Hoyer Larsen. He showed why he is the man to beat in 1996. The way he talked about his concentration has improved for the last two years. There he is right there shown, Amy. It's just unbelievable. What a comeback here. Well, poor Eric. Really rain. All-England champion. You can see. He got that one game now. So we got a great matches to come. You know that it's coming from the Danes ball, Eric Rohauer Larsen. We'll take a break. We'll be back with the third game in just a moment. Still in the interval between the second and the third sets. Just a reminder that the uh, Thomas Cup semi-finals conclude with the evening session of play, which starts at uh, 6.30 Hong Kong time, 4 o'clock uh, if you're watching from India. And that's play. Indonesia against Korea. Let's go back to the third and deciding set of this opening singles. China 
with Dong Jung had 13-1 lead in the second game, could not close it. And the Olympic champion advanced. But hey, you never know. Look at that big turn right there. Oh my goodness. Oh. Between the legs. Well, on Friday afternoon, we can see the three quarters of the spectators. They chose it right. <laughs> they come and watch. That looks good. And they went in. What a dramatic comeback by Poirier Hall Larson on the second game. Well, for both players, just must be relaxed. Yeah. Yes, it is tremendous to have a good start. There's love all. Just, oh, wow. It hit, I guess it hit the side part of the line. It's still love all. Oh, great shot. Just wide, though. Right, it was a great shot by Dong Jong. It was a great clear as well by the Danes. It just went wide. Good idea. Just oh. in. The three time, the third time. Stays in line. On the side as well. One, uh, one love. Uh, first game, first point goes to the Dane for Corey Larson. Great reception shot there. Well, that's a little erratic. Love one. Stadium is. Oh, yeah. One, oh. One all. Yep, going to big yikes. Now the score, one all. We got three servers and could not make the point, but now the fourth one. We got one point. What a speed by Dong Chong that was. Well, he had a problem with this control in this first game, and it showed again. Right here, great retrieve by Dong Jong. And again, with a flick clear, just land right on the line, on the baseline. We're back live. Three, one. Three, one. Right here, we'll just cut the tape and could not manage to climb over. Don't jump, get one more point. Now it's 3 1. Well, we haven't seen much of that. He hasn't put a lot of pressure on his smash in the third game. Right here, slight shot, then uh, a smash. One, three. Oh, this looks white. Yeah. This is <laughs> wrong. Instead, the other way. The first one, decision made by Paul Eric Hoyer Larson. Point, two, three. Patience and uh, force for Eric to make his error. That was it. Two, three. 
2-3. You know, you've been a tug of war with the rope, <laughs> pulling one away another. Yep. This is the way it is. Well, I'm doing this st the statistics now. It's over. You see, now 2-3, three. Three, three, two. 2 both times now. Two for the fourth time. That looks out. Four, two. Let's look white. Five, two. Well, somebody was helping. Dong Jung <laughs> from underneath here saying out. <laughs> it's got to be the coach or the whoever. Oh, there was a great slight drop shot there by Dong Jung. A great touch. Okay, inset just jump a little bit. Got one point, six two. Just wide as well. Two, it's two six. Three, six. I think more than Frost just told for Eric to force the forehand side of Don Joe. Just wide again. Four to six. Career height. A great bat hand there by Paul Eric. Going down a sticky time. No three points. to Dong Jung. Early report right there. Oh my goodness. Just land right on the line. A great choice in between. Instead of picking side to side. Now it's five six. Great play. I swear, it seems like I'm going in the roller coaster ride here, <laughs> going up and down. Yeah. Uh, changing momentum. <laughs> you can see right here, point by point. Six oh. Six oh. Both players are taking time. You see Ye Zhao Ying and the Chen Gang. Lu Jin Jin at the back. We thought this match would be over about 45 minutes ago. <laughs> <laughs> You're right. There he is right there. Not much of a smash from Eric Hoyer, but he doesn't need to. Well, there's an angle smash here. Players has to take a very high risk shot. Yeah. 
Great play by Dong Jong. Seven, six. Finally, Dong Jong broke the ice. Seven, six. Look white though. For the trees. Yeah, there's the first game of the third, the first half of the third game. In which the Chinese took the lead 8 6, Amy. Yeah, that was a great setup. And uh, you find a chance, the opportunity to jump up the smash on the forehand side of Paul Eric. Got a first eight point. This game is right there. Yes, Marlene Thompson, Camila Martin, and uh, Nakigor, and Lisbeth. Yeah, Lisbeth, Sean Lawrence, and everybody from the Danes are sitting and cheering. And for this man is for Dong Jung. You better not think about what happened in the second game. I honestly believe this is not this is not far enough for Dong Zhao to have the lead because playing in this side could be disadvantage for him. A oh, short one, and that one is wrong. Well, well, without the wrist, Six, eight. without the wrist movement, this is smash it long. I believe that this is when Eric, for Eric Seven, is going to eight. attack more yeah. than the first half or the first part of the third game. Change the drift is in his favor. In the yeah, that's it. In. Yeah. Oh. Uh, a couple days ago, we always talk about the drift uh, from the left hand side of Dong Joe. Yeah, the drift is going from left to right. That's yep. why if you look at the drift from his side to the left, uh, looks out, something you can go in. Great shot. That's a first leap again by the Dane. Uh, on the second half of the third game, 9-8. Like I mentioned, it is so disadvantaged playing in this part where Dong Jong is playing. Yeah, you're right. That's why the, 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 with the 8-6, it's a little, uh, too little cushion for Dong Jong. Uh, we'll see, though. 8-9. See, that's what I mean. Now, Paul Eric will start to attack more and more. There's this cross court as well as his uh, smash down the line. He's 9-8. What a play, what a shot. Oh, what a Eric. touch as well. Yeah, now, like I mentioned, he's able to bring down the shuttle much more sharper. Just know where he is. Oh, it could be the end of the day it's for the Chinese. I know the fat lady, lady hasn't sing yet, but <laughs> down 12, 11, 8. Oh. Jung is thinking. Well, he better start thinking quickly because well, Eric is everywhere. Well, nothing is going to stop the names now. 12 eight. Well, look at here. Really a mental game. We look at Dong Joe. The defense and the attack for Paul Eric is better. So far. <laughs> he can take more of a chances that way when you have the lead of 12 8 or 4 points in the third game. It's not going to be easy for the young serve in China here. Eight, twelve. Uh, 22 year old, Dong Zhong. This will be very difficult for him. <laughs> I don't think he believes that he can win from this side. Yeah. That's a big concern look in the uh, Chinese face. Oh, there he is right there. 12 8. The table has totally turned to Porek's eye. 
Play so smooth. from the Chinese supporter in this Queen Elizabeth Stadium today to overcome the Great Danes. Well, that's one. Well, he's same thing now when Paul Eric Boyer Larson was leading, or uh, was behind 113. Well, Dong Zhou can't take the whole thing in one shot. You gotta think about one shot at a time instead of the whole point. And reduce the deficit now to four, to nine. Now it's 13. Well, it's 10 13. My oh, goodness. <laughs> what they say? Well, um, he said, um, poor Eric also, breathless. Now, this is what I call about mind game. Can you deliver that punch? To get to the finish line. Now, Dong Jung has the little advantages. Well, not that time. 13-11. I don't think that poor Eric Hoyer Larson wants to get into this mind game stuff. The longer he's going to stay in the court, the more he's going to start thinking about the match point. That's yeah. when it start losing it. As you can see right there, Dong Jung just can't That's get that particular anxiety. There he is, Paul Eric Hoyer Larson in the match point. Would it be there like a copy of an option? Well, still, the Great Danes has not overcome the Great Wall of China of Dong Jung. the last gap from Dong Jun. It looks white. It is white. He's very undecisive in that shot. Think for a while and tried to be deceptive. Unfortunately, there was Well, out. there was out! Oh, my goodness! Look at that. Look at this. The picture of the champion of Paul Eric Weir Larson. If you young players, Amy, down 13-1, you can't let up. Take it one step at a time. Look at him right here with the supporter. Oh, oh my goodness. Oh, Dave, he's very happy Six, with that. 50, 50, and a big 70, salute to the champion, all England champion. Paul Eric Carter Larson, Thomas Thomas Stewart Larson, and Mike Sugar, everyone. Look at that face, and the Chinese are very concerned, Amy. Yeah, that's right. Uh, I think uh, the second match will be <laughs> another decider for the Chinese team. Well, the doubles goes to the edge of the Chinese, of course, with Zhang 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 playing in Lagusin and Christensen. But we will see. The momentum could go to the Denmark. We'll take a break and we'll be back. Ready to go. Recording. Paul Eric, what a superb game. Have you played in one like that uh, recently? No, it's a long time uh, since I have played a match like that. I must say, um, being down 13 2, something like that in the second set, losing the first, you never believe that you are able to, to come forward and, and win that match. I'm very pleased about that. Okay, it wasn't part, of, I thought it was 13 1. It wasn't part of the plan, was it? And then coming uh, back? 
no, <laughs> it wasn't definitely not. Yeah. Okay, I mean, when you, c you you obviously won that second set, I mean, did you you th feel that the momentum was with you going into the third? Yeah, well, I think uh, psychological, it's a boost for me when I come back and uh, winning that second set. It was very important. Well, of course, it was important because otherwise I've lost. But uh, I think uh, that psychological boost uh, gave me the power to to win the third. Did you play any different sort of shot? I mean, I noticed you were serving a lot shorter, yeah. a lot more often. And uh, I mean, what did you change tactically? Um, I was expecting him to, well, put pressure on me. And uh, he certainly did that in the beginning. And I really couldn't do anything with the smashes. Uh, so what I did, well, I had, uh, I should push him in the forehand, but it didn't, it failed completely. So in the second set, I was trying just to, to push him around on the back base, baseline and then, then come, come in with my cross cut and, uh, I succeeded with that, I think, because uh, all of a sudden he couldn't put pressure on, and uh, I came more or less uh, into the match uh, in the middle of second set, and I felt that, well, I have a chance now, so just have to, to fight for it. Okay, great start for Denmark, well done. Yeah, definitely, thank you. If you missed that match, the first match between Dong Jong playing again for Eric Hoyer Larsen, you missed a great one because somehow, somewhere, for Eric Hoyer Larsen, dig deep down 13 1 in the second game, went on to win with the score 15 11 in the third game. It was a fantastic win for the Danes as well as for Eric Hoyer Larsen of Denmark to have a good start, hoping to get into the final since 1973. I have a chance after the match with Ryan Langley. Let's hear what he has to say. Paul well, Eric, what a superb game. Have you played in one like that uh, recently? No, it's a long time uh, since I uh, have played a match like that. I must say, um, being down 13-2, something like that in the second set, losing the first, you never believe that you are able to, to come forward and, and win that match. I'm very pleased about that. Okay, it wasn't part I thought it was 13-1. It wasn't part of the plan, was it, And <laughs> coming uh, back? No, <laughs> it wasn't, definitely not. Yeah, okay, I mean, when you, c you obviously won that second set, I mean, did you, you feel that the momentum was with you going into the third? Yeah, well, I think uh, psychological, it's a boost for me when I come back and uh, winning that second set, it was very important. Well, of course it was important because otherwise I've lost, but uh, I think uh, that psychological boost uh, gave me the power to, to win the third. Did you play any different sort of shot? I mean, I noticed you were serving a lot shorter, yeah. a lot more often. And uh, I mean, what did you change tactically? Um, I was expecting him to, well, put pressure on me. And uh, he certainly did that in the beginning. And I really couldn't do anything with the smashes. Uh, so what I did, well, I had, uh, I should push him in the forehand, but it didn't, it failed completely. So in the second set, I was trying to just to, to push him around on the back base baseline and then, then come, come in with my cross cut and, uh, I succeeded with that, I think, because uh, all of a sudden he couldn't put pressure on, and uh, I came more or less uh, into the match uh, in the middle of second set, and I felt that, well, I have a chance now, so just have to, to fight for it. Okay, great start for Denmark, well done. Definitely, thank you. Well, what he was saying about he's trying to push him over left, right, and I tried to pin down this Dong John forehand, I really believe that the winner of that particular match, because of the minds of a uh, how strong and the concentration, the focus of Paul Eric Hoyer Larsen and winning it in the third games with the score of 15 11 on the third games. As you can see right there, the happy and very dejectful Dong Jong. Really not sure what really happened in that particular match.